Yes, sir. Got Bob Smith, nation's best football, on the line. We're going to bring him up. Bob, can you hear us? Can hear you good. Thanks, Brian. Yes, sir. Live action here from Jacksonville. We're freezing our tails off. How are you doing out there? Are you, are you feeling any cold weather? Well, I'm looking outside the window, and we got about four inches of snow. So <laughs> it's uh, kind of nice seeing the sunshine and everybody playing on grass. Uh, well, I guess we're I, very envious. I guess I shouldn't be complaining in the 49 degree weather. We still uh, can see the grass on the ground. But ultimately, thank you for uh, joining us today. I know you're sitting at the house or wherever you're sitting, and, and you're watching the stream. How's it look so far? Tell us about it. Well, uh, it looks like you guys are having a great day. Um, I see a lot of good catches being made by the receivers and some nice passes, and uh, it's also very nice to see the uh, attendance of uh, the fans on the sidelines. It looks like it's uh, you know the, a, a good tournament today. Absolutely. We've been having a great time. Like we said uh, earlier on, we've been out here literally all day, and, and the guys are really getting into it. Um, it's unfortunate we can't get that sideline action uh, to our viewers, but these kids, they're going after it. They've been playing a lot of football all day, but we're going to give a chance. We want to jump right into it. Uh, nation's best football. Uh, give our listeners a little background. Uh, you know, we've had conversations, previous conversations on not only Nation's Best, but uh, your background as well. Let's give the audience a little background on your media and uh, journalist uh, uh, sports career. Well, uh, appreciate it, Ryan. Uh, Nation's Best Football, we're in our fifth year, and we showcase all levels of football, uh, youth, high school, college, and pro. And we showcase players, coaches, uh, the things that are important, equipment, sponsors, uh, and then as well as the families and fans that uh, make it such a great game. Right. Now, what I really, what we really want to know is, is the influence. Uh, what you got, what got you so involved in uh, high school sports in the first place? Well, we're a football company, and uh, I've been a member of the NFL media for close to 25 years, and I enjoyed covering football at all levels. And uh, locally, we uh, we've got great scholastic football here in Virginia, and uh, an opportunity to work with. Uh, one of our spokesmen, Coach Rich Survey, who just got inducted into the Virginia High School Hall of Fame after 30 years at James Monroe High School, won a few uh, state championships. Um, so it's really an honor to cover those guys and all the players that go to D1 every year from their program. Uh, and, you know, we, we have a chance to showcase not only the local players, but uh, – with the programs we do on a national basis, we can feature some of the good players around the country. Well, that is outstanding. Uh, what are some of the things uh, Nation's Best is focusing in its efforts right now? Well, um, you know, we've been doing this now for five years, and uh, obviously the explosion with mobile media right. uh, has been really exciting. and. Uh, you know, when we started, everybody was looking at content over their laptop, over their desktop computer. Uh, it's all phone now. So for us, it's great. And we, our specialty is Instagram. If you go on our Instagram, you'll see we have uh, close to 17,000 followers. And every day, it's really exciting because we get to shout out the best pictures and videos of football players at all levels, as well as feature edits and artwork from some very talented uh, uh, artists from around the country that use a lot of apps on their mobile phones. Right. And then, of course, it's great working with the NFL and the other leagues uh, to showcase their product to the fans. Now, speaking of Instagram, we actually have your website page up right now and talking about some followers, 16.7K. And uh, as you're talking about these pictures, uh, some outstanding stuff going on. Any any uh, thing in particular? You got all types of athletes. Uh, you got some NFL. You got some college athletes. Um, are these pictures that that you all are creating, or uh, pictures that are being sent in? I see you also got some bleacher tags on there as well. Well, we're really lucky because when we started um, 
our Instagram, uh, we had some really good people that showcased um, their content on Instagram, and they said, hey, just do shout-outs. And so when we started, we started asking people to send us pictures and send us their artwork, um, send us videos, and it kind of blew up from there. You know, every day we have uh, lots of pictures that we showcase. We pick the best one. So uh, any of you football players out there that want to get recognized, just uh, DM us your picture, and uh, we do the rest. Uh, we've got our nation's best shout-out template that we lay on top of the picture. We add some hashtags, and as you can see now, you know, a picture of a high school football player gets, you know, anywhere from 300-plus uh, likes, uh, a couple dozen comments, and with the hashtags, they're forever on those threads for people to see. So awesome. if somebody doesn't see your picture today, they may see it a week from today, a month from today. Right. But, uh, you know, we're all about showcasing what players are doing. Well, that's just outstanding, and, and we've had previous conversations, and, and we're so glad we're able uh, to team up on this 7-on-7 seven on, seven on seven event, and we got some action right in front of us. They're, they're running by us. Uh, once again, Bob, we really appreciate you coming on the broadcast. We really pre- uh, appreciate everything you're doing, not only for us, uh, but for the student-athletes around the nation. Uh, that It's a real passion for uh, both of us. And also, once again, ladies and gentlemen, Nation's Best Football. You can follow them, social media, at Nation's Best FB. Bob, we really appreciate you coming in. And uh, any last words for our audience? I uh, just uh, want to thank you, everybody, for tuning in today and watching some great 7-on-7 seven seven at the tournament. And, uh, you know, we really appreciate what you guys are doing with the Keeping Dreams Alive Foundation and the things that you guys are doing with uh, HSTN Sports, um, you know, Like Lazaro Suarez from Bleacher said before me, you know, you guys have given a great platform for players to be showcased not only locally but uh, regionally and nationally, and that's what it's all about. And, uh, you know, thanks again for a chance to be a part of uh, today's event. Absolutely. Thanks again, Bob. Once again, we're going to get back to this.